The latest in military technologies and uniforms were on display today, and WNCT's Jacqueline Matter was there to get a firsthand look. She has the latest from today's Marine South Expo aboard Camp Lejeune. Nearly 100 vendors came out to today's expo, showcasing everything from state-of-the-art combat vests to light and compact satellites to virtual battlefields. The Marine South Expo wrapped up its final day Thursday, but drew thousands of Marines in to show them the latest technology and equipment for training. For one retired Sergeant Major, he says everything he's seen at the expo was a newer version of what he used when he enlisted. You look at what we have today, um, it, is, it is night and day. From guns to lifelike casualty dummies to radio essentials, younger Marines say they're looking for what makes their jobs easier. To make it faster, easier to use, lightweight. Vendors are also looking to get feedback at these expos of what Marines are looking for to use in the battlefield. For example, a year from now, that Marine could come back and see that prototype and go, oh my God, there it is, that's that thing. That's what I need, we need on the battlefield to fight and win. One of the vendors that incorporated feedback from Marines is Bohemia Interactive, which makes software of virtual battlefields. They say since many of our current Marines grew up in the ages of gaming, these lifelike training methods give them a more interactive experience while saving the Corps millions of dollars. Go in and do all the what ifs in the mission rehearsals without spending fuel, ammunition, or time on the ranges, which is very valuable. The software allows you to choose any location in the world and grabs images from that area, letting you virtually train like you're actually there. The Marine South Expo will be held in April of next year. It will also be held at Quantico and at Camp Pendleton. Aboard Camp Lejeune, Jacqueline Matter, 9 on your side.